Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Alan Anthony from Phone Tech at Work and today we're going to take a look at a case for your iPhone 14 Pro Max and it comes to us from Subcase. This is the Unicorn Beetle Pro for your iPhone 14 Pro Max. So let's start the video, show you what I'm talking about. Pow. Alright guys, so here we have the Unicorn Beetle Pro, one of the big boy cases when it comes to the iPhone 14 Pro Max or just in general. Whenever you see the Unicorn Beetle Pro, this means there's going to be a lot of protection, very similar to Autobox at a way affordable price point. I will have a link down below if you guys want to check it out. Alright guys, so let's just take a look at the packaging here. Unicorn Beetle Pro, right here from Subcase, what it says on the back if you guys are curious. And you have your 100% authenticity, basically. Drop protection, military standard, drop tested approved. All right, so the first thing you see, that it has that pattern there, so it should be good for the max safe. But this does actually come with the clip and the holster, which is always a plus. All right, so let's just see. So it does have the built-in screen protector on this one. So... There is actually a guide to actually show you how to do this. Please remove the protective film tempered glass protector on the mobile phone before installation. So it's saying not to use tempered glass, but I've I've actually used this case with a tempered glass. And what I actually do is I actually pop off the um the front screen for the case itself. So just to take a look at the case itself. You do have a nice little pattern here that actually adds a little bit more grip. Um, it does have a plastic feel to it. This is definitely has a hard plastic to it. And it has a button where it actually pops out the kickstand. Which is way better than the last one. See? So you just got to put your nail in there and pop it out. It does have a carbon fiber type look up top. That's probably just a sticker. And this is kind of like a metal gray so it's pretty simple how to use this case so it's it's kind of like the outer box defender if you guys never had that case before this is the inside just like so and on this case you do have the built-in screen protector so you do actually have to peel that off now i can actually peel this part off for you guys put it over here and let's peel this part off as well just gonna do a nice little demonstration for you guys Right, so how you install the case is you just have to match up the button and just make sure that the volumes are on the right side. So you just have to fit it in there and drop your phone in, just like so. Then you just take the second part of the case and you just have to fit it over. Basically drop it in and just make sure that it's all closed up. Very simple how I did it. And sometimes it actually falls into place so you really don't have to do much work. As you can see from right now, how it looks really, really good. It's all closed up. You do have a little flap there for your Mio toggle switch. Volume up and down it is pretty clicky. And let's take a look at the camera right over here. Looks pretty good. It does add a little bit of protection, but there's a lot more protection when it comes to the front lip over here. So that's pretty good. And on the bottom, you got the cutout for your charging port and the little flap there so to protect it from any dust from any water or anything like that but you guys let me know what you guys think about the unicorn beetle pro i do have it in another color we could check that out i'm not gonna show this one i'm not gonna unbox this one but i could really show you how it looks All right so this is the purple one now it's a little okay so that's the natural color right there hold on let me bring down the brightness for you guys All right, so here's how that purple one looks. Looks really nice. I think the official name for this one, I'm not positively sure. It should be on the box somewhere, but I will have a link down below. So what do you guys think about the purple one? It matches absolutely perfect with the iPhone. So you guys let me know what you guys think about it. And when it comes to the holster, so you basically, you just fit it in just like so, and you can pop it in or pop it off. Or if you want to rock it like this, Pop it the other way, move it around, and you can make a stand. 
Can you make a stand on this one? Nope. It doesn't look like you can make a stand on this one. But if you face it down just like that, maybe you could just see. You see, so it actually stands up no problem. But if you guys want to take off the case, because a lot of people actually ask that question as well. And you got the logo for stuff case right there. So you just basically have to peel off one bottom. So if I was you, I would go at that bottom right. But bottom right like so. Pop it off. Just like that. And just peel the whole fun out. Just like so. So very simple. I'm not going to make this video super long how I do usually with cases like these. So you guys let me know down in the comments which one do you like. I will have a link down below to all the colors and you guys can pick one. And um, that's about it for the video. If you guys have any questions, let me know down in the comments below. If you guys like this video, hit it with a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And follow Phone Tech at Work for more videos like this of the iPhone 14 Pro Max and more tech to come. Peace and love. I'll see you guys in the next video.